Hello everyone, I'm Axel Gear, and this is Let's Play Earthbound. Last time, we defeated the sharks and got here to the giant step where this thing's blocking the way. I did a little leveling off screen and I also had a terrible loss against it. So, this is what my stats look like now. I have 614 experience to the next level, 87 of 91 health, 30, p 30 psychic points, uh, 25 offense, 17 defense, speed 5, guts 8, vitality 6, IQ 6, and luck 7. Also, I learned PK healing, which cures cold, sunstroke, or sleep. You learned that at level 10. So, you finally got here. Just scrolling up. Um, I'm, I'm gonna start using the wiki off screen so I so I know things. So first, sanctuary boss, Titanic Ant. He's flanked by two black antoids. His he has 235 HP, 102 PP, offense 19, defense 23, speed of six, and guts of nine. He has five attacks. He has five techniques he can do. He can use a biting attack, which can deal either low or high damage. I think that was more high damage. He can use defense down alpha to lower my defense. He can use shield alpha to cut physical damage in half. Or, or he can use PSI magnet to drain pain psychic points from me. P. K. Techno! Let's take out those black antoids and deal massive damage to to Titanic Ant in one fell swoop. Ouch. Be -e techno. Ding. I'm faster than it, so I don't have enough PP to. Okay. Eat a burger, eat a burger, eat a burger ness! Eat a hamburger, yeah! Yeah! Yeah, I lost so terribly against it before. Ooh, I already leveled up. Offense 2, speed 1, vitality 1, 14 more max HP. Good. And now... We enter the first sanctuary. Ness caught a glimpse of a small cute puppy. Ness's soundstone recorded the melody of Giant Step. We still have a long way to go. That was only the first of eight. But hey, if this were the if this were the end of the game, it would only be the series would only be five episodes long. <laughs> and now look at that. The the enemies are gonna run away from me now that I've beaten their boss. <laughs> I spawned right on top of him. <laughs> How much experience to the next level? 821, yikes. Hey, magic butterfly, thank you. I needed some more psychic anyway. I'm gonna kill some guys. I'm gonna get some experience. Hey, Macarena. <laughs> it does sound like the Macarena, doesn't it? Yeah, you call for help. That'll just... 
that'll just, uh, let me get some more, uh, experience off this one fight. A cookie! Okay, I'm just gonna go. What's even over here? Ooh, there's a cop down there. I don't know if I- oop, there's the magic butterfly that I was looking for. And it's gone. Great. If I walk over by where the cop is, then come back, yeah, it worked. Come here. There's a cop down there. I wonder if he's, like, gonna question me about something. Okay, that little bit of slowdown there was not my computer. It's the ROM itself. When there's a lot of... When there's a lot of sprites on screen, your game is going to hang a little bit. Hey you, the board says do not enter. Couldn't you read it? Um, officer, I I got permission from from the mayor. I could read it. So you just didn't want to read the sign, huh, kid? Get your butt to the one at police station later. Uh, officer. God, the police in one at are terrible. They won't, they didn't do a thing about the sharks and now they're arrest and now they're gonna arrest me probably even though I had permission you know what I gotta go home and heal real quick and um I'm gonna clear up something I mentioned uh, a couple episodes ago I think episode three about stats. I said that I didn't know what Vitality, IQ, or Luck did. Vitality increases how much HP you gain in on level up, and it and it also um, decreases the chance of getting certain status conditions. IQ does the same thing, but with psychic points. And Luck determines how much you heal from eating a lucky sandwich. Ness? Ness. Ness. I'm a friend you who you have never met before. My name is Annie. Can you hear me calling you? I am Annie. Ooh. We've heard from we've heard about Annie before. From someone in town. I mentioned she's a She's a special girl who lives in Tucson. Good morning. John, he still doesn't want to go out. Okay. So let's go down to the police station, I guess. Now, what do I have on me anyway? No money. Plenty of food. Now, the first time I played this game, I made the mistake of going straight to the police station. I was really hurt from the Titanic ant fight. I went straight to the police station. That was a horrible mistake. You want... You really, really want to heal up before going to the police station. I'd rather be working as a parking meter cop. It's been too busy lately. I'm sick of it. Man, am I steamed. Don't even try talking to me. So here you are. You're that little delinquent that came back from Giant Step. Now you listen here. Don't enter means just that. Do not enter, you got that? And furthermore, 
blah 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 blah. It's usually those tax evaders who blah 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 blah. We don't enjoy blocking off the roads, you know. Blah 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 blah. It's usually the local whiners that make make a big deal about emergencies and meteorites. Blah 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 blah. Okay, sir. Why is the road to Tucson closed? An emergency, of course. Times like this, kids like you should be playing Nintendo ga- Um, I am playing a Nintendo game? I'm in a Nintendo game, officer? Are you sure you want to go to Tucson? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Follow me. If you say so, officer. Whoa. Game- Game slowed down a bit. Show me what you got. See if you can get past five of my best men. What? Yeah! Hey, small fry, you must be shaking in your boots. Yeah, talk about... Talk about police corruption. The police of Wenat are going to gang up on a little 13-year-old boy. So, you're gonna, you're gonna have to fight five of them, obviously. They have 75 HP each, nope, no psychic points, 15 attack, 18 defense, 5 speed, and 7 guts. They can either bash you, or attack with a crushing chop which deals high level damage. Ouch! I would recommend trying to save your PP for, like, late. You're tough. You should join the police force. Your average policeman is stronger than any superhero. Stronger than the Hulk? Stronger than Superman? Didn't think so! Hold on. Nom nom nom. Haha. -ha. Right. Oh, you won. Don't let the mayor's compliments give you a big head. Bring it on, fat boy! <laughs> okay. Arrogant, insulting to citizens. What kind of cops are these? If this is one at its finest. I mean, I mean, yes, I know I eat hamburgers, but still. I ate a lot of hamburgers, but still. There, okay, that's third down. Let's do this again sometime. Next time, I'll take you out with my nuclear suplex attack. Come on, I'm gonna take you apart right here, right now, baby! Yeah, it's pretty much the same fight five times in a row. Yeah, I lost. That's it, buddy. You can forget about me. I'm gonna call for my boss. <laughs> okay, so it was only four times in a row. There's no way I can beat you in a straight competition, so... Get ready for my Super Ultra Mambo Tango Foxtrot Martial Arts! Now we have to fight Captain Strong. The captain of the police force. He has 140 health. No psychic points, 20 offense, 24 defense, 15 speed, 8 guts. And I'm gonna heal. Oh god, oh god, oh god! Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! <sighs> yeah, that's the worst thing that can happen. Losing to, uh, Captain Strong. Because... You have to then fight all five of them over again. Hey. 
It's... It's so monotonous fighting them! Well... I guess we'll... I guess I'll, uh, get back to Captain Strong off-screen, then. And... Get, and you'll see the real fight with Captain Strong next time on Let's Play Earthbound. See you guys.